Hi guys! 24 hours for you, 5 seconds for me. We're going to get straight back into what we were doing now. Um, first off, a bit of light hammering. Um, I'll try not to take too long with the hammering. Don't want all my goods to f spill out of this, so we're just going to give that a bit of a whack. Get it up a bit. Come on, come on. Don't want to give away a base that's falling to bits on me now, do I? Let's just take my ear out so I can hear myself speak a bit better. Okay, so... That's going pretty good. That's going pretty good. That's really doing a good, nice job on that. Now, um, I just want to have a quick look because it was at... It was at... Um, 740? Now, well... It's not bad. No. Uh, barbecue doesn't even look like it's got a bar on it. So, I guess the barbecue doesn't break as easy. Animal trap? Animal trap doesn't look like it's breaking or anything. Um, a barbecue furnace? Definitely is, so I'm going to get that up a bit. And the next I'll do the bench. Don't worry guys, I'll give you a full 20 minutes or action packed adventure. Um, but this really needs doing, because I don't want, I don't want anything else to die like the bee box did. Oh, that's lovely, that's, that's really good, that's good, okay. That's enough for you. Get this fixed. I love how the, um, the animation for it is me damaging <laughs> the bench. I mean, you know, can't be asking for too much. They do a wonderful job. That's my opinion, and I'm going to stick to it. Favorite games do a wonderful job at this game, and I've said it before and I'll say it again. This game is every bit as enjoyable to me as any of the Blizzard games that I've played, and I'm a diehard Blizzard fan. I mean, when it comes to computer games, I, um, Blizzard have done all right by me. They really have. And I can't thank them enough for all the hours of fun I've had over the last 20 years. 20 years I've been playing these games. Right? I don't... I, I didn't get to play Vikings, and I didn't play Orcs vs. Humans, but I got World of Warcraft. Uh, not World of Warcraft, just Warcraft. And that's where my love affair began. Uh, what about the door? door, oh the door's down too, and just keep bashing on that door, door's the most important thing, I don't want to get raided, uh, if someone comes along and sees a door with only a quarter inch left, they're going to do their level best to get for that door, it's a metal door, so it'll take a bit of getting through, but I've seen determined people, you only have to watch some of the kill cam updates, um, videos to see what a group of coordinated individuals can accomplish, Hi Killcam by the way. Loving your videos, dude. Check him out guys, he's pretty good. Um you also I would like to make a mention about Asafin Network. They they were oh I broke it. Um they managed to dispute with me over the um the um video that I was trying to post, the Hearthstone one. I got flagged copyright and it said Asafin, so I emailed them, I googled them, found them, emailed them, they were nothing but professional, they apologised for the inconvenience, and they promptly got rid of the copyright notice off my video, and you know, I got nothing, I watched a video about their members, they all rave on about how good they are, so if you're after a network, maybe um, give them a look in, I'm happy being independent, to be honest. Um, excuse me for one moment, guys, while I cough. <coughs> Sorry about that. Too much talking and not enough drinking of water. But a bit of dry mouth. Um, yeah, um, I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Hydration needs fixing. Let's go ahead and have a stew. Gobble gobble. Boom! Up go the levels. Gotta love that, right? 
Sadly, no new crates, but, um, you know, it'll happen eventually. It's... Um, right, so I fixed up my gear. I'm pretty good, so what I'm going to do now is maybe build some walls. I think that's uh, an appropriate thing to be doing now, don't you? Uh, walls, 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 walls. Um, do I want to build up the outer walls? I think maybe I'm, I'm going to do that. I'm going to build out, I'll build up the upper walls on the outside. I'll do that first. I should put a dummy, dummy door into my complex. Well, it's not really a dummy door. There's enough room for them to stand on it and then try to make their way on my base. So. Sorry guys, talking to myself there. Um, yeah, upper walls, I think. Upper walls are the way to go. I'm going to craft me up a bunch of those. There we go. Oh, I need to have me, me, me. I'm going to have a bloody axe on my person. Axe. Oh, axe. What about over here? Axe. And there you go. One axe. Open that up. Oh. Uh, well, I can do a bee box now, apparently. Should I? Do the walls first. The walls are more important. Gotta get this base finished before, you know, wipey wipey time. Upper metal walls. There we go. Craft a maximum of six. Let's see if it actually does it now. Hmm. I did one. There's two. There's three. Oh. Nope, not three. Not pussy cat. Upper middle wall. Because I can still do three more. Yeah. Keep trying. We've got two sheets of metal in there, so I guess I'm going to try again. Oh, it takes four. I wonder. Metal walls take four? Oh, they do. Oh, they two. It was two at one stage. I'm sure it was. I'm not going crazy. Um, where's that furnace? Okay, furnace. Do your thing. Break that down. Thank you. Okay, so got that done. Um, what am I doing next? I'm uh, making a metal wall. Can I craft metal walls? Because I did have one metal bar left over, didn't I? Actually, I need to make a hammer. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I am actually going to make a hammer craft. Okay, I've got a hammer, um, it's saying I can do these things, but that's assuming I break stuff down. I'm not going to fall for it, to be honest. I know I don't have enough metal brackets for that. Um, so, yeah, go fish. Let's go place these down then, shall we? Uh, have your planks back, I don't need them on the person. And I'm going to go and rescue that thing and then go around the other side of the dam right after I've done that. Levels are still good. Everything is good. Okay, so. It's going to um, go in here. Place up the walls. Now in hindsight, didn't even need to come in here to do this. Could have done it from the outside. Oh, actually, I've got some, got some tasks to do here. A couple of empty bottles to fill up. There we go. 
And seeing as I've still got my axe on me, maybe I should do a wood run. Oh dear, fell off. That's twice. <laughs> I don't even need to jump, you just walk. There we go. Okay, um This side first, I think. Bear with me. Suspicious now, doesn't it? Um, that's going to go bye bye now anyway. There we go. That's that wall up. No more jumping over the top. Uh, unless they're smart. Yeah, yeah, there's that, I guess. Okay. How much time have we got left? we got 10 minutes left. Okay, wood run. Um, no, not wood run. Repair mission. Oh yes, repair mission. Off we go then. Back into the proper mode. Yeah, it's got a bit, um a little bit foggy around about. In my way, bonehead. There's a ton, an absolute ton of zombies back there. I wonder if they would be attracted. Science time, guys. Science time. Let's see if they are attracted. Hmm. I'll place it here. I'll place it anywhere, apparently. Oh, oh well, can't place it there, can't place it there, that's fair enough. Can you place it on this ground? No, I don't think you can. It's the same type of ground. Oh well, moving on. I just thought, you know, maybe do some sights and see if they're attracted to parachute flares, but it's not going to let me put it down well of titties. Maybe it says something in the, in the description about where it can be placed. Um, placed on the ground, trigger a parachute. No, man. Hmm. Doesn't let you put it on this ground. Maybe it lets you put it on this ground. We'll have a try. There you go. Hmm. Oh well, there you go. Didn't seem to attract zombies, so... I guess that's a no-no. Might as well check these cars. You never know. New weather, maybe they spawned new gear for me. That would be totally cool. Uh, one cloth doesn't really do it for me, so I'll leave that. Does mean that they have actually spawned new gear. Two scrap metal I'll take. Siri, what about you? 
the scruffy hair, but still broken. Yep, still broken. Okay, not to worry. That's not looking too healthy either. Um, I'm going to have to swap that out for that. And don't worry, my little friend. I'm here to protect you. I know it's not that exciting, guys, but, you know, um, it's one of those assets that I actually really enjoy having. Been with me since the beginning of Season 4, so this needs to get done. I'll just take it to half. That should keep it going for a while. That's it, buddy. Keep going. Going. Almost there. Almost there. I'm watching a lot of things on YouTube, just by way of conversation while I'm doing this, about flat earth theory and, and all this lunar landing is a hoax nonsense. I've got some people are stupid. I can't believe anyone would believe in that stuff. They've got actual... Um, when they did the moon landings, they actually placed a lot of reflective um, markers on the moon in, in one of the areas, and the scientists can shoot lasers at it, and that's how they can tell that the uh, the um, moon is actually moving further away from the Earth. I think it's like 12 inches every 10 years or some ridiculous amount like that, but it is actually slowly moving away slow down quite a bit I would imagine it used to be a planet called Athea I believe and it collided with Earth of course there, these people would be saying that's a load of nonsense I mean I've read Terry Pratchett novels where this world li is literally a flat earth type theory type thing where it's on the back of a giant space turtle but oh my god that's <laughs> seriously I actually used to work security in a federal building where the, the government scientists worked out there. And they, that was part of the space pro. They looked after the space program, and they used to conduct experiments. They showed me the experiments they used to conduct, where they'd shoot high-powered laser at the reflectors and beam it back, and just to calibrate and stuff like that. Quite interesting. I'm, I'm a bit of a nerd when it comes to astronomy and stuff like that. Noise probably attracted that zombie. Yeah, so yeah, I watch a few of those type of things. It's funny though, isn't it? They know that so many people are going to be against them spouting such nonsense theories. And keep in mind, I'm the kind of person, you know, you want to believe in Jesus and God or religions that, right? Go ahead and do that. That's between you. And um, your makeup, I com completely respect that. But um, please don't try to make me subscribe to it. <laughs> I've got my own views on such things, and I like to live and let live. But oh my god, sometimes it's very hard not to say some stuff. To those kind of people, because you know it's dangerous in the sense that they're. Oh, hello, Mama. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I don't believe in him, but I'm quite happy to say, excla exclaim his name <laughs> when I get a car full of scrap. Oh, so someone took all the scrap out of his car. I moved it into that car. Show you inside? Nah, I don't need to. Oh, uh, yeah, no, I really, really don't need to. What's the time, anyway? 
Oh, we're just about done for this episode. I'll tell you what, I'll um, check the cars upstairs and then run back to the base. Without falling off a cliff and killing myself, because, you know, one death per batch is plenty. Someone's been eating rabbits. Yeah, I'm not having any nonsense. <laughs> I didn't do I didn't change the color of my boots I will do it just not now bear watch seems to be devoid of zombies oh sweet mother <laughs> Woo -wee. gotta like that guys gotta like it Yeah. Can I not pick that up? Oh, hang on. Let me just fix that up a bit. There you go. Now I can pick it up. Oh. I'm one of those trucks. Oh! Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I want the duct tape. I will not be outwitted. Oh. Oh, yeah. You lose, car. You lose. I don't, however, need the tarp so they can get stuffed. <laughs> I got like six tarps from that lockbox behind my base. The lone survivor stalks through the olden area looking for pipes to several which in order to survive another day. Sorry. A little David added me there for a moment, but um, I'm better now. No, oh, really, I'm... I'm oh, jeez. It's just got a lot more foggy. Or is that... It just got a lot foggier? Or the fog just rolled in? I don't know how you say it. He's staggering into punjis. Oh, I'll take those. Thank you. Can I carry more stuff? I can carry more stuff. I'm gonna bob the builder the shit out of this place. Oh look, he died. As you can see, zombies aren't too smart. Walked straight into the sharpened punjis and got himself ganked. Whereas the human survivor nimbly jumps over the top. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Take that and that. Guess I'll, um, take them with me, eh? Uh, I need that to make the last of my shotgun rounds. Hmm. Hmm, apparently we should be able to pick one more up. There we go. I have to look. Do I thieve it? No. No, I'm not going to be that kind of guy. So. Oh, bunny rabbit. <laughs> he's off. And he's off. Oh, well. Oh, a new chain link fence sound. Did you hear that? Chinkara chinkara? Am I? No. No, you may not do it. 
But I want it. I want it so bad. No, you may not. Fine. Have it your way. Leave, leave one for someone else. Should we listen to that sound again? There you go. Interesting. Thankfully, still no walls on the base. Let's head home to our base. Being ever so careful not to fall to our death. Wow, it's even foggier now, isn't it? Ooh, shit on toast. That did a bit of damage to me. I don't like that ledge anymore. Go in here. Um. Alright, first things first. Throw that in there. Um, anything else? No? Oh, the dirty water. The dirty water. Oh, I lost my swizzle. One of the things that I must have lost. Yep. Yeah. Uh, crafting berry juice. Gonna craft two, why not? And I'll drink one right now. That'll get my levels back up, and I'm gonna make my bee box, because, you know, I can. Well, there's the dilemma. Do I make the bee box here, or do I make it upstairs? Hmm. Upstairs. Gotta start thinking of that. Sorry, BK. I'm going to start thinking that I'm moving house soon. Um, I'm going to put the hammer in there. And uh, the scrap metal goes in there. And the eight sheets go in there. And I'm going to put these, these ones in here. Um, go to work on that. i uh, got some stuff to put in here as well. Some duct tape. I'll ground that down. Do I have another one in here? I do. Now I can craft a shotgun around. I can go in there and then we can craft explosive tipped arrows. You know, why wouldn't I? <laughs> I've got 20 other suckers now. I am kicking ass. I'm going to take that on board and those on board as well. And then, uh, my friends, my friends, we're going to check the furnace, make sure. Yep, there you go. And now we can craft those metal sheets. Maximum. Okay. Now we go and put those in here. Should be able to get one or two walls out of this. What's we on for time? 28 minutes. Oh, geez, we're over a bit, guys. We are over a bit. Um, see if I can off those outer metal walls quickly. Craft the maximum metal walls. There's one. There's one. Can I do more? There we go. Doing more upper walls, doing some planks, doing another upper metal wall. There we go, got four four of them there now. Um and no, three. A three, and that's all it's going to let us do because um the other stuff is, you know, gotta melt it down. And we're not going to do that, so Go fish. Can't make that either. 
Okay, well, we're going to leave that one there like that. We're going to relax ourselves. We're going to turn around. Uh, it's a bit dark in there, isn't it? Okay, guys, well, that was another episode full of excitement and building and crafting and stuff. I hope you enjoyed yourself watching my video. Um, I certainly enjoyed making it for you. Uh, do the liking and subscribing and all those fun things. Um, if you do have an issue with the episode, feel free to dislike. All I ask is if you're going to dislike it, at least give me a reason why in the comments section. It doesn't take long, really. Just, you know, put your gripe in there. Um, I'm a pretty fair guy. I'll listen. I'll, I might even reply. You never know. I do try to reply to everything. I mean, I've only got 55 subscribers. It's not like Flash the Royal or PewDiePie or someone with a gillion people on the side. So I do have the time to do that. So I will try to do that. Anyway, I digress. Thanks for stopping by, guys. It's goodbye from me. And it's goodbye from him. But see ya. H1Z1 will return tomorrow at 1500 hours, Australian Eastern Stereotype. Hope to see you then. See ya.